When married parents divorce, courts make custody determinations based on the best interest of the child. This determination often includes various factors, but some factors are off limits. Arthur v. Arthur explains the role of a parent's religion in custody decisions. Cindy and Michael Arthur married and had four children, Megan, Mary, Eric, and Jacob. The family became members of the World Harvest Church. Michael worked for the church, and the children attended the church's school, World Harvest Christian Academy. Michael eventually began to pull away from the church and left his job there. After Michael moved out of the family home, Cindy filed for divorce. At trial, a court-appointed psychologist, Dr. John Mason, expressed concern that the academy isolated the children from society and provided a substandard education because it had small classes, staff shortages, and experienced teachers, no academic curriculum, and no competitive extracurricular activities. Mason also testified that Eric and Jacob had a strong interest in competitive sports that the academy didn't offer. The trial court awarded Cindy primary custody of the girls and awarded Michael primary custody of the boys. In addition, the court implemented a visitation schedule to ensure that all four children would be together for 185 full days and 72 partial days per year. Accordingly, the court entered a split custody judgment. Cindy appealed to the Ohio Court of Appeals, arguing that the trial court improperly separated the children and gave Michael custody of the boys based on her religion. 